So Hogg has a chance at four and a half minutes. Full forward for Richmond, puts it on its way, and it's a bad kick. It will sit nicely. And a huge clip by Smith. Couldn't get it. Here comes Keyes, who was high. And there's a goal to Richmond to Gale. Gale got it on the left boot and went through. And Richmond are ahead. To Whiteman. Whiteman grabbed. Play on was the call. And scooting away with the ball was Russell. A quick hand ball to Shaw. Shaw's in trouble. He dropped it. They found its way to Monfort. Monfort gave it to Bowie. But good tackle there by Richmond. The ball came out to Lambert. And a very intelligent kick by Lambert. Lands it with Nate. That's good football, Tigers. And Nate will have a shot from 25 metres out. Right in front of goals at the railway or scoreboard end. Richmond 2-2 two -two to 2-1. Two 16 and a half minutes into the first quarter. And they're pacing it with the Magpies in the early stages of the game. Here's Nate. Coming in now, putting it on its way. Goal on five will signal a goal. That's Richmond 3 2 20. Leading Collingwood 2-1-13 on the 3 AW Makita BBC scoreboard. Here comes Banning for Richmond. Transfers play to Lambert who marks. He's got Underwood over the top, but he can't. Good interception there by Russell. It went back to Underwood. Underwood runs around nicely. A shocking-looking kick will spill inside 50. Knights overruns the ball. Shaw is cleaned up for Collingwood, and the umpire saw it. So Tony Joyce playing the other way. I don't know why. It's going to be a goal. The hog. That has absolutely floored me. And it's floored Tony Shaw, who thought he had the kick, but he was paid to be in possession. Advantage play, two to hold. Richmond 4 2 26, Collingwood 2 1 13. Bannock a high ball in towards the centre of the ground. Turner will have to wait. Nearly took the mark. Young needs support. He did it well on his own, but here comes Des Ryan giving him that little bit of support. Running through the centre, Lambert has got it. He's got a short wait, but if he wants him, and wait and takes the mark. Runs inside 50. Better hurry up. Here comes Prasiska, but it's not in time. Goal! Even if it's not a goal, it will be another kick. Prasiska late on the scene. Gale now will line this football up and kick from 53 and a half metres almost directly in front of the punt road in. Breeze at his back from the southwest and he puts it on its way. Magnificent goal. Last kick by Gale. Through the eye of a needle. Collingwood at 10-5-65. Richmond 8-5-53. 16 and a half in. It's uh, two goals of difference here in favour of Collingwood. Monkhorst, I fancy, got it again. Lambert getting plenty of possessions. Weaved his way out of there beautifully out of that pack. Kicked it away up towards the half-forward line. Still on the member's side. Knocked off the ground by Nace. A chance for Knight to be backed up. He's kicked it out in front of him. Read it pretty well. Then he gets it out to Ryan. Des Ryan under the left foot. And he's put another goal through. Good play, Richmond. And uh, now they've livened it up. And it's a nice sort of a game. This Collingwood 10-5 leading Richmond 9-5, 18 minutes into the quarter. Gets his free kick on the centre wing position on the member side. A goal and put the Tigers in front. Pumping away was uh, Gafer. Over there to and fro it goes. It's knocked out. Out to uh, Nation. Nace has kicked the goal. That's a goal to uh, Richmond and they're in front, the Tigers. That's his second. Richmond 10-6 to 10-5. And the last five minutes have been fantastic football. Stephen Ryan has got this kick for Richmond. Will transfer play across to Knights who will mark in front of the late arrival of Wright. So Matthew Knights has got it and he's got a player on his own if he wants him across there. And Richmond will go forward through Turner. Turner gets the ball in towards the half forward line and the mark comes out and is taken by Des Ryan. So as Des Ryan now goes in with a long looking left footed kick, it's meant for Keyes. Oh! and Mark by Hogg uh, coming across the front of the pack a la Royce Hart style and took a gem he's got four he's a dead eye dick and he'll kick from 27 and a half meters when he puts the ball onto the boot he's deliberate he's got four and he's got five Richmond rampant at the MCG 11 goal 672 Tigers Collingwood 10 65, 23 minutes. And Richmond got their nose in front by eight points and they've done it well. The ball about to be kicked back into play. And here it is, coming back into play, right up the middle of the ground from the boot of Gaper in towards the centre of the ground. At the back was Knight, showing the better judgment. Hand pass very quickly, across to Underwood. Underwood to Lambert, a left foot kick. And he's kicked the goal. It's a little rip ball. Oh, what are they And Richmond, goal seven. This is great. Great football by the Tigers, the way they've come back. 
Broad end of the stadium. Skips, runs in, bangs a ripper outside 50. Cloak from behind. Moncourt stumped it down. Went to Waitman on the draw. The hand pass went out to Knights. Knights inside 50. A high ball. Hog. Key. Hog. That is all. And he ran straight into the erect goalpost. He runs around. Centre knocked out by Moncourse, picked up by Cloak. Fresh air shot, Lambert hand pass towards the ever reliable young boy there in Campbell. Very impressive, kicks it down. Free kick to Hog against mighty Mick Gaper, who tried to sell the umpire the idea that Hog had hold of his strides. But Hog has got the football with half a dozen hanging on his belt. He probably is a Monty to have seven within seven minutes of the third term. So Hogg, 45 degree angle, 32 metres will be the spot where he'll put the Sharon onto his boot and he's very meticulous and it's a goal, it's a goal, Richmond magnificent with Hogg has kicked seven. 14 minutes into the quarter, the Gale knocked it down to Lambert, great player Lambert, a hand pass out giving Young the run at the ball, Young pushed it here, pushed it there, picked up very quickly, booted back towards centre half forward, a chance for Underwood. Underwood streaming away, has a snap for goal from 50 metres out. It's a chance, it's a chance, it's a goal. Oh! Oh! oh. 16 12, the Tigers playing absolutely inspired football. Collingwood 11 7. Uh, Prasiska on the mark at centre wing position on the member side of the ground. Stephen Ryan sees Lambert alone and unattended, and Lamb, uh, Lambert unobtrusively wandered in there. He's got the ball now at centre wing on the member side, and he kicks it around up towards the half four line. And Gale drags in a big mark. Well, they're doing it well. Gale, we saw him kick that uh, enormous goal in the second quarter. Keys is giving him the lead. He's kicked it, and he's got the mark. Keys got away from his opponent then. And he's taken the mark between centre half forward and full forward. Lambert walks up with a word of encouragement. Nobody would like more to kick a goal against Collingwood than Keyes at this particular moment. He was giving his mark, given his marching orders, and 16, 12 to 12, 8 could easily become 17 if he can kick straight. He hasn't kicked a goal today. Coming off the 50 metre line now. 16, 12 to 12, 8, just on the 18 minute mark of the third quarter, and Keyes comes in, puts the boot on the ball quickly, and it's a goal. That's a nice goal to Keyes. And the Tigers, you couldn't believe it after halfway through the second quarter, you couldn't believe that by now they would be, as they are, 17, 12, 114 to 12, 8, 80. 3 W Dan Murphy Sellers scoreboard. The ball spinning back into play. Morewood tried to knock it out, didn't, but uh, Gale did. Big Dale got it out. There's Ryan. Ryan across to Waitman was good football. And the little captain has kicked the goal. Oh, that was great football. There's no doubt about it. That's his second goal. It's a beautiful goal. His first one was a lovely goal too. Paints his eyes from the evening sun here in metropolitan Melbourne and chooses out a half-back flank outside 50 looking for Christian who goes up but he's beaten conclusively over there by the big fellow Gale who has been magnificent in the aerial duels this afternoon. So Gale has got a shot one. Hog! <laughs> Hoggy! Crowd were chanting Hoggy. After seven, they'll be chanting all night because he's going to line up for number nine. He is a dead-eyed dick man, is Jeffrey Hogg, a friend of Graham Bond, as he lines up from 42 metres out. We will go into that after we go off air, and he's kicked a goal. He's kicked nine. Nine sausage rolls to jumping Jeffrey Hogg of Richmond. He has the key to the city. Richmond 21-13-139. Collingwood 14-8-92. And dare I say it, yibbity yibbity, that could be all for just a smidgen outside the 50-metre line. The draw on hand passing to Francis. Low kick towards Alan Richardson. Couldn't take the mark over the top. Tony Free kicks it out to Lambert. He'll mark hand pass further afield to the running Smith. Smith, a worm burner to the lead of Hogg.
and you can't get away with that, Mick Gaper, because apart from 24, 28,000 people seeing it, the umpire saw it, and I saw it, and I yelled that hard, I reckon he heard me say it, so he blew the whistle. So here's Hogg, he's kicked nine. Dead Eye Dick from Punt Road has got his sights on double figures for the first time in his league career, and the friend of the Bonds have done Jack Skinny Titus's record of 10 goals kicked by a Richmond player against the Magpies. So we need another one for Hoggy Ball back in the centre, umpire Bird. Kicked it upfield, but Christian reaches out and takes the mark. Hand passes over a desperate Andy Goodwin to Barwick. Barwick better hurry, and he's kicked the ball around the member side of the ground. Right reach, but it wasn't an effort. Pickering, Michael Pickering has it under control. Pumps a hand pass to Knights. Knights on centre wing has chipped it upfield, and Goodwin, and Goodwin's got the mark. On the half forward line, he sees Hogg coming up and passes to him. Hogg will stretch, couldn't get it. Couldn't quite get it, it was wafting away. Towards the opposition, Gale over the top to Christian. Christian runs towards 50 and scoots it out to the lead of Starcevic. Good play underwood, beautiful mark. Hand passing across to Stephen Ryan. On the draw, beautiful pass across to Knights. Goodwin screaming for the ball. He wants to get into this game at 28 metres. And Matthew Knights has got it. So he kicks it there to the lead of Lambert. Magnificent player, Lambert, today. A good one, man. Get him the can of it. He's gone right off the crew at 28 minutes. He wants to fight. You don't want to fight, son. You want to drink. And here we go at the house of Stouts. Fancy fighting over this. And the Richmond crowd who booed Bartlett off against the Sydney Swans are going to span to cheer him to a man. As the ball goes forward from Lambert. And a... No, they've got to bring him back. Free kick to Andrew Goodwin, you would not believe. The crowd will go absolutely mad. Because here it is, the Goodwin. Listen to them. The natives are restless here this afternoon. As I said, they'll all be staying to cheer Bartlett off after throwing cans at the man for two weeks. And here comes Bartlett. He's going to make it the last stand for us. Bartlett comes down. Great victory for ball men here this afternoon. Everybody's gone mad. There's Goodwin kicking it up towards the full forward spot. Hog in front, knocked it down. It's picked up by Nation. A quick snap for goal. Oh, he's kicked the goal. Unbelievable. Well, now that's his third. Richmond have picked 24 goals, 15, 159. To Collingwood, 15, 12, 102. And they're rubbing their nose in the dark. this morning I would think. Wait for trucks back on the ground. It's a scene to drink in. Collingwood getting off the ground as quickly as they can. Richmond getting together as quickly as they can with a final score of 24, 15 to 15, 12. And there's what Bondi told everybody. Jeff Hogg has kicked 10 goals to equal the record for a Richmond player against Collingwood. And that was the great uh, Jack Titus and Richmond players congregate in the middle of the ground to drink in this game.